Donald Trump caused controversy when he said Meghan Markle was nasty during his UK visit. Now the president explains why he said it. Donald Trump claims he has made up with Prince Harry after a row over whether he called Meghan Markle nasty. The Duke of Sussex had a friendly chat with Mr. Trump when they met during his state visit, the US president told British journalist and TV host Piers Morgan, reports The Sun. He insisted he never meant to insult Harry's wife when he criticized her nasty comments about him. I wasn't referring to she's nasty. I said she was nasty about me, he said. Mr. Trump was interviewed by the Good Morning Britain host in the Churchill War Rooms this afternoon, local time. During their conversation, due to be shown in full tomorrow, the president said he built bridges with Harry when they met at Buckingham Palace on Monday. I congratulated him, and I think he's a terrific guy. The royal family is really nice, Mr. Trump said. Despite the prince's frosty look in some photos, Mr. Trump denied there was any tension, saying, no, 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 just the opposite. In fact, he spent a lot of time talking to Ivanka and talking to my family. I went up he couldn't have been nicer. In an exclusive interview with The Sun last week, the president was asked his views on the Duchess of Sussex criticizing him and replied, I didn't know she was nasty. But Mr. Trump told Morgan, they said some of the things that she said and it's actually on tape. And I said, well, I didn't know she was nasty. I wasn't referring to she's nasty. I said she was nasty about me. And essentially I didn't know she was nasty about me. You know what? She's doing a good job, I hope she enjoys her life. I think she's very nice. Before joining the royal family, Meghan predicted Mr. Trump's election would drive Americans to move to Canada. Mr. Morgan shared a snap of himself with Mr. Trump on Instagram and captioned it, just finished a 33-minute interview with President Trump in Churchill's War Rooms his only UK or US TV interview during his state visit. This was Mr. Morgan's fifth interview with the US president who was on a three-day visit to the UK to commemorate the 75th anniversary of the D-Day landings.